All right, here's another edition of LMB The Show Franchise Mode Diary. This time we're the Cubs. Um, so wasn't a great win, but you know what? They found a, the Cubs found a way to win and get beat the Brewers and win 10-5. to All right. So to get the go scoring started, Kyle Schwarber hit a uh, two or a solo homer to get the Cubs on the board, not only in the run column, but in the hit column too. So he hit a solo homer, make it one nothing Cubs. And then Jason Kipnis, surprisingly, got a homer his first of the year into right field, make it a 2 nothing Cubs lead. Then the fourth, homers by uh, Wilson Contreras and Ian Happ uh, made the score 4 nothing Cubs. And then the Brewers got on the board. They uh, basically and not only got on the board, but took the lead. To begin with, uh, Ryan Braun doubled into right field to score uh, Eric Sogard. And then, let's see. And then, yeah, Christian Yelich tripled up base, clearing triple at that. He scored Manny Pena, Ryan Braun, and Lorenzo Cain to make tie it up 4-4. And then... Uh, Alasayul Garcia ground, grounded a single in the center, ground a single in the right field to score uh, Yelich, but he got tagged out uh, trying to stretch the single into a double, make it a 5-4 to four Brewers lead. And then just like that in the sixth inning, the Cubs took it right back as Victor Caratini hits a pinch hit, do or pinch hit homer into left field. Make it a six, make it a five, or make it a um, tie ball game, five five. Then the uh, Cubs took the lead back as uh, David Bodie doubled into right field to score uh, Javier Baez, make it a six to five Cubs lead. And then let's see. Then in the eighth, the Cubs stretched it out. Uh, Ian Happ uh, hit a sack fly to score uh, Caratini. And then let's see. Then uh, Jason Kipnis doubled, so he was basically a triple shy of the cycle. So yeah, so he didn't get it. Yeah, but he scored in that double. Scored Kyle Schwarber, making an eight to five Cubs lead. And then the Cubs basically just put it away after that in the ninth inning. Uh, Jason Hayward rounded a single into center field to score Dave Bodie. And then let's see what else. And then Victor Caratini hit a single. Into a right into a left field to score Jason Hayward, make it a ten to five Cubs lead, and that's where the final score would stand. As your Cubs win and take the rubber match in this game, in this series, a uh, ten to five. All right, Jason Kipnis, as I said, is your player of the game. He was a triple shy of the cycle, but he went three for four, a homer, a double. The win goes to a uh, Craig Kimbrell as he came out of the pen and basically uh, held on for the win. He uh, pitched a one-third inning, um, gave up no hits, no strikeouts, did not give up an earned run, and he walked nobody. And the loss goes to uh, J.P. Fryerstein. Um, he went one and third innings, uh, gave up four hits, uh, did not strike out anybody, gave up three earned runs, and walked nobody. All right. So two and ones for the Cubs this season. So they kind of bounce back after the last time they played. So very good. All right. See you guys. Banyana.